There has to be a way inside the ship. I'll radio when I've secured a path. Not done going through hell yet. When the packs started to flee the city, Monroy rounded up every last one of them that stayed behind, that were loyal and trusting, and threw them into these labor camps. What I know of the packs, they could not have survived long in there. It was all Monroy. When he understood the packs were turning into ferals, he sent out an order to murder them all before they could transform. All of them. All but enough to run his camp. Monroy returned to the city to find it under siege. He battled for days, a complete bloodbath. And then, another storm hit. Monroy's people were decimated. That's when they spotted the Flores in orbit. 
and called for help. They started broadcasting the signal. But it couldn't get through. Help never came. And Monroy ordered a retreat to their ship and locked it down. All this time, all we've been through, the battlefields, the jungles, the alien ruins, the desert, all we've lost. I can't believe we're finally here. The goddamn signal I heard the day we landed. And still, none of it makes any sense. Oh, I think I'm starting to put it all together. The way the Pax controlled the anomaly with their obelisks, they are what kept the planet's energy in check. They were the balance. But when Monroy stopped the Pax from using the obelisks out of pure fear of what he couldn't understand, the anomaly spread like wildfire across the planet, the storm surging out of control, mutating everything. All this time thinking we were gonna reach a place beyond the anomaly. 
only to find the place it all started. Where Monroy started it. They're the ones who got left behind. And half of them probably slaughtered the rest for a last seat on the caravel. Tanner and Yako, we all should have been down there with the rest. Hopeless. Drowning in chaos. Nothing but dictators and madmen set loose. If the caravel's engine hadn't exploded and killed most of the outriders... We would have been the ones left on Earth. Two more soldiers in Mamroy's damn army. Fighting for any way off the Earth. Coming here to slaughter the packs and screwing up the whole damn planet before you all ever set foot on it. I'm inside the ship. It's still operational. Whatever's playing the signal, it's in here. Let's finish this together. Signal. We're here. It works. 
Oh, God, it works. Someone hit the lights. Look, it's exactly as I saw it, as we saw it. Jana, that's not real. That's this planet, all right, but it's long gone. No. No, it's... Get the fuck off! It's... Today. You okay? Oh. You're, you're here. I, I, I imagined this so many times. Never you. Who are you? Who am I? <laughs> Nimroy? But how? How did you, how did this ship get here before us? How do you think? You people left us to die as the earth crumbled. But I don't die so easy, do I? No, we built a, a new engine. An engine that, that chained all others before it. So while you were still crawling through deep space, we were already here. <laughs> Oh, you should have seen it. Their primitive civilization, the natives, they treated us like gods. Yeah. I've seen what you did to the natives. Oh, oh. I see now. This isn't a rescue. Why didn't you come when we sent out the distress call? Huh? It's 30 years since the Flores arrived in our skies. 30 years surviving in this hell. This hell was because of you. My entire life trapped in that valley, slaughtering each other for nothing. You robbed our people of hope before we even got here. Well, don't flatter yourselves. You were as capable of every wickedness. The packs weren't as docile as they looked. They had powers. So much power. Things I had to understand. So you just rounded them up? You tortured them, you son of a bitch. Are you really so naive? How long before those creatures tired of us? Before they turned against us? They would have had us on our bloody knees. All that I wanted was their powers. For us, for all of us. So we could survive, so we could be strong. Don't you see? We lost the Earth because we were meant for something more. There. But for the grace of I go you, my child. Do you think that you would be standing there with the powers of a god if it hadn't been for me? All that I've done for humanity. They saved us. You cursed us. But I won. It's done. Fuck him. No more wasting time. I have to tap the uplink into the caravel's power so we can reach the floor as before we... Shit. They found us. We gotta go. No, no. Leave me. I have to do this. Do what you gotta do, Doc. That door won't hold long. Outrider, if that beast cracks this ship's hull, we lose electronics, we lose the pods, we lose everything. I'll take care of it. You just get those pods down.
Tahiti? What's happening in there? It's working! I've contacted the Flores. Transmitting the first launch codes. Now! Almost there! over the signal the uplink it was all for nothing wait guys look over there the pods it, it works you did it. My God. I guess some of the commands went through after all. Well, like I always say, it ain't over till it's over. <laughs> what the hell? Monroe's people? No, I don't think so. Who are you? We're from the war zone. Are you the Outriders? We heard tales about an altered Outriders opening the frontier, finding a cure in the forest. We've been following your trail since the war zone. Keep moving.
did it. The fuckers did it. I still don't understand how they went back in time to get here sooner. They didn't go back in time, stupid. Their ship was just faster than ours was. I don't think that's true. In the end... Only Monroy and a small group with him survived the slaughter outside the walls. They hid in the caravel for decades, waiting for rescue from the Flores. So sorry to disappoint them. Clearly things didn't go any better inside the ship. Nope. Supplies ran out, and they hunted each other down, one by one, until only Monroy was left. A fitting end. You remember anything about Earth? I remember a roadrunner and this uh, coyote. I remember laughing so much I couldn't stop. It's amazing to think they kept playing cartoons right to the end. I mean, my whole generation, we went to school, we played games online, we hung out with our friends, knowing we wouldn't grow up. Well, you did. Yeah. I grew up to see most people I know die. Grew up a refugee with bombs falling every night. And yet... I still feel guilty. So, how many exactly have attempted this little run at the forest before us? Seven. Seven expeditions. Some long ago, before we even knew what we were dealing with. The most recent, about five years ago. And they knew. They knew exactly what was waiting for them out there. And they still went. Zahidi told us everything about the caravan, Monroy, the packs, 